When asked, what do you want to be when you grow up? Most kids say, I don't know. One group of high schoolers definitely knows. At 17 and 18 years old, they are well on their way to making it happen. In tonight's New Mexico Works segment, the story of a unique APS program that is turning high schoolers into tomorrow's workforce. This is not your typical high school classroom. They clear the patients. It's the Albuquerque Public Schools Career Enrichment Center. How do you stop the bleeding? The kids here come from a number of different APS high schools. They are learning to be nurses. Their teachers are registered nurses. <laughs> Open the airway more. And they get a lot of hands-on experience. Well, my mother is a nurse. My sister's a nurse. We have a lot of people in our family that are nurses. So um, my mom told me, and I wanted to be a doctor in the future. So my mom told me this would be a great start for you. Gino Lamberti is a junior. He sacrificed a lot to be here. He moved all the way from Las Cruces. I love the medical part, and I also love getting to know other people and, you know, finding their story out, making, trying to make a difference in their life. Katie Amberg is a senior. Her journey hasn't been easy either. She goes to class here at her home high school, El Dorado, and is in softball too. But she says it's worth it. When she and the others graduate, they'll be able to take the test to get their nursing license. The students' learning doesn't end in the classroom. They get to come in the hospitals and help with real patients. Do you have to chart? The students spend several hours a week in clinicals. 25 milligrams per tablet. Hi, do you remember me from earlier? Yeah. Helping them along the way, veteran nurses. Many of them graduates of the program themselves. It takes a special teenager, um, someone who's good at time management, time management, someone who's organized, someone who's dedicated, someone who cares about people and knows that it's about people and compa compassion and, and that sort of thing, but they can do it. Jocelyn Amberg is the director of the program. She says 100% of their kids graduate from high school. Last year, 100% of the students also got their nursing licenses. It is not your typical high school experience. Other people, they don't understand when I talk about clinical at the hospital. They're like, wait, you take care of an actual person? But these are not your typical teens. A lot of them come back and they say, you know, at high school, we're, they're talking about what shoes go with their prom dress, you know, and I held the hand of a patient who was dying, and that just meant so much more. The APS Career Enrichment Center also has programs for law enforcement, building trades and construction, cosmetology and computers. The demand for the classes is very high. Students do have to test to get in. Now, if you know of a success story for our New Mexico work segment, send me an email at kim.vaez at krqe.com.